Duluth has countless breweries throughout the city, and recently some have received statewide recognition for how good they taste. And Duluth Breweries brought home eight of the top prizes at the Minnesota State Brewers Cup this year. Northern News Now's Madison Green tapped into the science behind the beer to learn how they brew it. Blacklist Brewing Company's Hefe Royale took home the crown in the German ale category at the Minnesota Brewers' Cup this year. When I went to brewing school in Chicago and Germany, I fell in love with Hefeweizens. Um, so I, it's always been kind of my baby of styles of beer, and we don't get to make it that often. Co-owner and head brewer at Blacklist, Brian Schatzenbach, crafted the recipe for this prized pint, requiring very few ingredients. And we're talking wheat and barley and the right percentage, so it's not a complicated recipe temperatures during mash, temperatures during fermentation, and how the beer is treated really throughout the process dictates all those flavors. One, Schatzenbach forgot to mention, water from Lake Superior. So what is it about this that makes this taste so good? It doesn't have a lot of, um, of what we would call hard water minerals in it. So it doesn't have a lot of calcium and magnesium, and that can really affect the flavor of the beer. Making the flavor combinations. You can do anything you want with the water here, where in a lot of um, a lot of areas they have to actually take the water, purify the water, and then add in the the components that they want. And the memory creation. When I'm not working, and the place is packed and everyone's having fun and drinking beer that you made, that's the number one reward. Endless. In Duluth, Madison Green, Northern News Now. And other breweries in our area that also brought home the hardware include Ursa Minor, Canal Park Brewing, and Vent Paddle. All